Setting up the venue. Upon arrival at the venue, it's a good idea to make sure that the room is configured correctly for the optimal presentation effectiveness. The rule at pharma meetings is generally this. All participants must be able to easily view the screen with no obstructions, which means, for instance, if you have one long table, the screen needs to be at one end of the table with no one seated at that end of the table so that attendees can look down the table and see the presentation with the picture unobscured. If the tables are set up in cafe style rounds, they are set so participants are seated in a crescent formation with the front of the table open, once again so that no one has their back to the presentation. If the venue has done these types of presentations before, they will be aware of this and have the room set accordingly. If the room is not set up in one of these two configurations or the popular U-shaped configuration, you may want to mention it to the staff, but final say is always at the discretion of the representative. Needless to say, the room should be set up in the safest and most efficient manner possible. Cables across any doorways or any open flooring areas must be gaffing taped for safety's sake. Audio cables cannot be run directly parallel with power cables or you will get a resulting RF hum. Cables that run along the baseboards can be taped for safety's sake at periodic intervals. Speakers need to be set up in front of the presenter whenever possible to avoid feedback. However, you must realize that the wait staff needs to be able to move about the room without tripping over our speaker stands. Obviously, the projector and the screen must be aligned in the center of the room. Whenever possible, the venue will provide you with a projector table, which is usually a small cocktail table with a skirt. If you should have to set the projector up on the end of the dinner table, be cautious with the cabling both on top and beneath the table. Don't finalize your taping routine except in highly dangerous areas until the rep has signed off on the setup of the room. Once that occurs, you can finish your taping and make sure the setup is perfectly square and looks great cosmetically. Instructions on how to set up the individual items will come in the following lessons. The next lesson will involve how to greet the representative and speaker once the room has been tentatively set.